My guest today is Brooke Spurs, local photographer. Good to see you. Good to see you as well, sir. We're here to talk about photography. So uh, Brooke suits for uh, this venue, The Post. Uh, a lot of live music. You'll see them everywhere. Uh, Billy Bob's. I'm sure you'll tell us where else you, you photograph. But uh, how did you get into photography? Gosh, uh, photography has been a part of me before I even knew it, I guess. I was taking little disposable cameras down to Green Hall when my parents uh. would take me to see music acts when I was as young as fifth grade. What really pushed me over the edge to go professional yeah. is um, uh, my daughter being born okay. and wanting to be close to the music. I've always gone to concerts mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, always had to be front row to be close to the music. So I thought, hey, this is a great mm. way to be able to be front row backstage however I can you know to be closer to the music and get in for free yeah, as well not? right not? Yeah. <laughs> so tell us about your favorite maybe three photographs you've taken I know it's hard to pick but you picked a few uh, just start yeah, talking about some so, of them so the first one that comes to mind uh, really set up the shot you know what I try to do is uh, again I'm a fan mm -hmm. of music so the more you know the artist the more you can kind of predict moments in the show mm -hmm. um, this wasn't exactly one of those moments this is more of a lighting moment mm -hmm. but um, at the uh, Ridgely Theater here in Fort Worth, uh, Charlie Crockett was doing a, uh, <clears throat> a uh, hometown show, I guess, and uh, there was a, a beam of light that just a single beam of light showing on him in between a, two songs, mm. and I missed it at the time. I thought, oh man, I'm gonna wait for that again, wow. and thought about, okay, I'm gonna get in position okay. for when that happens again, and so I waited and waited, and in fact, set the, the whole next song from that vantage point and didn't get a whole lot of shots just waiting for that shot sure enough after that song it it did the same wow. thing and I was able to snap it and okay cool. it's one of my favorite live music awesome. photos two more well I got to go with my daughter you know okay. she's my number one model I, I uh, took a I shared it with you mm -hmm. guys uh, the uh, photo I took of her at uh, what is it uh, uh, Mexican food place oh. Joti Garcia Joti Garcia of course how could I forget <laughs> that patio yes, yes. Um, and she's looking up just Blue oh. eyes, red hair is yeah, just my favorite cute. shot. Yeah, Thank good. you. And uh, then, gosh, another one that comes to mind. What else did I share with you guys? Oh, a recent one. Yeah, I try to do something different. You know, I've been in so many photo pits where it's photographers are just shooting the same shot, you know, and I'm, I think mm -hmm. to myself, how can I get an edge to be a little bit different? Yeah. And so, uh, Recently, Jackie Vinson, which is an Austin uh, musician, um, was playing, and I and I saw the stage lights uh, lend itself to a star burst photo, which hmm. I don't always get the opportunity to do. How do you get these amazing shots at these live shows? Because I know what it's like to go there with a nice enough camera and to just shoot, but you, you might get lucky, but you get like 20 great shots, and we share them on the weekly Instagram quite often, as people I'm sure recognize. But what, what's your secret? I appreciate that. There's a <laughs> lot of good photographers, and I've seen y'all take some great shot as, uh, shots as well. But first and foremost, I try not to be seen mm. because I know that as a music fan, I don't want a photographer in my way. Oh, so I try to stay really low key, and you know. Okay. Um, but as far as getting the shots. Um, a lot of people will tell you equipment doesn't matter, okay. but um, when you're dealing with low light situations, oh, yeah. you're going to want you know some equipment that can handle that, lenses and whatnot. Yeah. Um, and then getting those angles, so many times we are limited depending on the size of the show of where we can be, uh, but really networking and asking questions and seeing where you're able to be, whether it be side stage and not just on mm -hmm. the front. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of moving parts and variables and there's a lot of times where you're like, man, you know, hope I got the shot, you know, mm -hmm. hope I get the shot, you know, and you know, usually it, it works out if you, if you shoot enough, you know, and, mm -hmm. and do your research. Okay. Well, what tips do you have for aspiring photographers? <clears throat> Gosh, I'd say uh, just be confident, uh, mm -hmm. get out there, um, talk to people, mm -hmm. network, um, don't be shy. Um, be aggressive talk to the venues that's how uh the relationship started here with uh, yeah. the post I, I walked into fort worth live actually i messaged him and said hey do y'all ever if y'all ever ever need any photography mm. you know, let me know and uh brooks the talent booker here um messaged me back and said uh, we need you tonight and i said perfect i'll be there and then you know i've, I've had a relationship with uh, this mm. venue or fort worth live former their former venue and now here for over three and a half okay. years. Tell folks uh, where to follow you. So you can follow me at uh, 
Brooks Burris Photography, um, at Brooks Burris Photography on Instagram, Facebook. Well, Brooks, it's been fun getting to know you. Uh, often people don't know what, what these uh, photographers look like, so now people will recognize you, and I'm sure you don't mind if they come up and say hi next time you're Absolutely. out here shooting at The Post or Lolo's or somewhere else. Absolutely, and come up and they, say hi. They yeah. can ask a question or two and get some tips from this uh, veteran uh, forward photographer. So. I appreciate that, definitely. Yeah. yeah, come say hi for sure. It was fun talking photographs. <laughs> Absolutely. Have a good summer. Yes, you as well, sir. Thank you.